Ever since I went on my first flight, I knew that aviation was for me. It was exciting, it was enthralling, and I just fell in love with it. I got interested in aviation about midway through college. I was at the University of Oregon and I was wanting to learn another language to try and be a flight attendant. I realized about halfway through college that I could apply myself a little more, get, you know, be more educated and try and be a pilot. A typical day starts several days before. First, we have to coordinate our schedule with our student. Next, we have to analyze forecast weather conditions. Do my planning, if I need to make a flight plan, I'll look at the weather, see what the trends are, make a flight plan based on that. Then we have to check ourselves, our physical condition, our mental condition, before we go out to the aircraft and conduct our pre-flight inspection, where we walk around the aircraft, we check the fuel, we check the flight controls, the tires, the oil, everything that we need to make sure that the aircraft is going to operate safely. And I would also study up my maneuvers, whether it's to the different takeoffs and landings, whatever that lesson is for the day, make sure I know how to perform them. Then we get to the fun part and we get to climb in the aircraft, me and the student side by side, starting up the engine, taxiing, doing our engine run-up test, and uh, conducting the flight. I've always been into being a little different, and so getting into a male-dominated industry was definitely appealing to me. And I went on my discovery flight a year and a half ago or so, really enjoyed it, and now I've been in the program for over a year now, finished my private pilot license. It's okay if you're not perfect. Um, that's not the name of the game. It's just staying on top of it, you know, getting back up and keep going at it and you will be successful. In the Aviation Academy, you're going to have obstacles. Uh, whether it's learning all of the jargon associated with aviation or just the immense amount of hard work and dedication that it takes. But if it's something that you love to do, and you're having fun, then it makes the learning process very easy.